That's what I think we're going to be in for with this one. Technical, progressive, perfection, tight, tantalizing, uh, titty tasting, very good stuff. Um, our friend, our wonderful pal Miko, is back with a request, and it's for, uh, is it called Golden Mouth of Ruin? I want to say it's called Golden. I've heard that little bit there, and he, he already rips a, a, a freaking drum riff that I could never do in my life. Golden Mouth of Ruin by Arc Spire. I think uh, we we have done Arc Spire, Arc Spire, and I was calling him Arch Spire. I want to say that the way I'm saying it is correct, but I have many people that yell at me and call me bad names. They say things, terrible things about me. Um, so we're going to call him Arc Spire this time and save me a little bit of headache. Uh, Golden Mouth of Ruin for Miko, our friend, our wonderful friend Miko. Miko, do you know what this is? It's just, it's something that's going to come popping up any minute. It's coming. It's popping up. Boy, boy. There it is. It's a channel changer. It is a channel changer, and it's for you. It's all for you. So we're going to get into this. This is a brand new song from the band with official video. I think this thing's only been out one week, and it has hundreds and hundreds of thousands of plays. So we're going to get into it, and we know that, I mean, I'm looking at a still image right here, and the damn dude has six strings on his bass. I mean, they they know what they're doing. They know they 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 know what they're doing so much that they take the four string bass. They say throw that in the garbage because I need two more strings, right? Technical masters of what do you what would you call it? Technical death metal, um, technical metalcore. I I don't I don't know. I, I get so in the weeds on all the little sub 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 genres. But uh, channel changer in hand. Here we go right now for. Arc Spire, Golden Mouth of Ruin. I mean, a drummer is just a... Ooh, I like that. I wonder if the singer ever feels kind of left out. I mean, you gotta... That doesn't have a head stuck in his guitar. How's the string staying on? I mean, how do they not forget where they're at in the song?
I mean, it's like this is, a, this is where they get the mosh pit going. That's a great one. So happy when he can just do that. You have to be a certain kind of badass to 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 perfect this kind of playing with a bunch of dudes. I mean, you gotta be healthy. You gotta go to the gym before you play this. I, you know, it's just it's uh, it's uh, it's it's bewildering. It's bewildering to me because it because it's like not only are those guys absolutely proficient and 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 and, and amazing at what they do. There's there's five of them. You, how many bands have you been in where you can't even get the goddamn bass player to show up on time? Let alone practice. Bro, have you practiced? You know, there's always someone in your band. Have you practiced? You don't sound good. Have you figured out how to tune the guitar yet? Go buy a tuner. And you've got these dudes that just get in there and do that. I mean, who's the weak link? I'm asking that question. Good, great, fantastic. You can you can answer some stuff because my favorite part of the video is where I get down there and I read your comments about this because you're much more smarter people than me. So you're going to be able to put this in the proper category in the sub 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 uh, genre that it is, and you're going to be able to explain this much better than me. All I know is that is masterful. That is that is technique. Uh, right there. Uh, so good, great, fantastic. Shane, huge fan of the band Arch Spire. Really? I'm a fan of the band Arc Spire. Um, what are your all-time favorite songs from the band? What are your all-time favorite albums? And what is the show like? Have you been? Have you seen them? How many times have you seen them live? And what is it like? Is it people just standing there with gape mouths going? Or, I mean, is it just insanity? I feel like you need a, you need a, uh, uh, sh a shot of ginseng or something before you go into one of those concerts. Or you could say, not good, not great. Shane, it was masterful, technical, uh, very progressive, very fantastic. They're, they're, they're easily some amazing uh, players in that band, but it's just not my cup of tea. I like something that kind of bounces uh, in the 4-4 four, four time. I like something that lays back and rocks and talks about summer, you know, driving the car in the summertime. And uh, this didn't do anything for me. It's not my cup of tea. I'm going to give it a hard pass. All of that can be put in the comments below, don't you know? Because I love to read the comments. That's my favorite part of each and every one of the videos that I do is your thoughts, opinions, and positions on the artists that we do here, okay? So that's all I have for this. Um, the fantastic Miko coming in with that. And yeah, it's just, it is, it is uh, a mind bender, really. Uh, if you have a hard rock heavy metal special request, you wanna see it on this channel, it's a simple process you can uh, click one of those links in the description below. We will get it on for you. I think I'm wearing one of my shirts. I do have some Shane D t-shirts. I don't know if you'd be interested in those, but that link is also down there. You can always put your comments in, uh, put your requests in the comments and we will uh, get to them if we get to them, when we get to them. Okay, that's all I got for this. Orcspire. Mm.